Also this noon time, a fire at a local church we told you about first on Eyewitness News this morning. Part of the New Life Worship Center in Smithfield was damaged. Eyewitness News reporter Steph Machado is live this noon time working new details. Investigators look into what led to those flames. Brian, investigators are still on the scene here at this church, which went up in flames earlier this morning. They're trying to determine what caused it and whether it was intentional or accidental. This corner of the New Life Worship Center torched after going up in flames around 6 a.m. The side of the building that's enclosed in by a fenced in area is where they keep temporary storage of trash. Michael Sweeney is the chief of fire investigations for the state fire marshal. He says those trash bins were full after a church service and gathering with refreshments last night. The area accessible through an unlocked door. The fire penetrated through the wall and into the interior. Um, and there's a lot of smoke damage inside the structure. Sweeney says no one was inside the building at the time of the fire. Investigators from the state fire marshal's office, Smithfield Fire, and the ATF are now investigating how it started. Accelerant dogs were on scene and have now finished their work. Sweeney wouldn't say if they found anything. Investigators have not ruled out anything when it comes to how the fire started. I, th I think anything's possible. Everything's still on the table for us as investigators. And firefighters have been using fans to get smoke out of the building. It's unclear when folks will be able to go back inside. But the good news here is that this church was already planning to have church services at the Vets in Providence for Christmas this year. So the worshipers here will have a place to go for Christmas. Live in Smithfield, I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News.